If shorts are concerning you because of your age or your size, stay tuned for today's video. Hi there, welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah and I am the award-winning style coach here to help you refine your style and increase your confidence. Today's video is all about shorts. We are in the middle of summer, even though I'm wearing boots today because it's raining outside in Ireland. But it is warm out there and so you might be thinking of getting your legs out and wearing shorts but you may be concerned about wearing them for a few different reasons. Maybe you're concerned because you are a certain age or maybe you're concerned because you're a certain size. So I'm here to address this and help you out with making a decision about whether to go for shorts, what style of shorts and all those other things. So before we get started, can I please ask you to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you have lots of clothes and nothing to wear, you might be interested in my online courses, they're linked below. And let's get started with today's video. If you've been following my YouTube channel for a while now, the first point I'm gonna make is maybe one that you will have expected from me. Wearing shorts at any point in your life, no matter what age you are, or indeed whatever shape you are, uh, whether you're um, full figured or you're slim or you're average, anything at all, petite, tall, whatever, and you're here looking for answers to figure out, you know, should I be wearing shorts? The answer is simply, you get to wear anything you want at any stage in life, at any shape or size that you are. You get to decide what you wear and you get to decide how good you feel in those items. What it comes down to is your level of confidence and nothing else. So it may not be a case of, you know, wondering whether you should be wearing something at a certain age. It's about the confidence from the inside and maybe that's where the work needs to be done and not on choosing the right pair of shorts or, you know, the right style of shorts or whatever it might be that's concerning you you've got to feel confident enough so that you can wear anything you want. And I've demonstrated this by wearing a plastic bag before. I believe you can wear absolutely anything you want if you have the confidence to back it up. If you don't have the confidence, maybe that's time to do some work on that area from the inside, on your beliefs about yourself, on beliefs about what's acceptable in society, all of these types of things. Maybe it's there that you can focus on working on rather than kind of saying, oh, I'm, I'm now in my 50s or now, you know, whatever age you are, and you're thinking, oh, maybe shorts are not appropriate. Maybe sleeveless things are not appropriate. That's all BS. You wear what you want. If it makes you happy, do it. Now, of course, I'm not gonna do this video without addressing some of those things like, you know, the most flattering shapes that you could go for um, or the length of shorts and all this. I am going to address that too. What I have found to be the most flattering style of shorts are a very classic cut that are high-waisted and they have kind of a, a wide leg on the short and they come down to about mid-thigh. So they're giving you a nice bit of coverage. They're not clinging too tight. Um, they're not attached to a certain age profile. Anybody could wear a pair of shorts like this. They're not like their denim hot pants or something like that, where the gusset is like non-existent. There's good coverage in these. They're loose enough. They kind of come high-waisted to give you that comfort level. If you want, you could also bring them down into a little kind of a Bermuda style uh, so that they give you even more coverage and cut just above the knee, which is a really flattering look as well. You really can't go wrong with this style of short. It's a very timeless style and it is very flattering for many different body shapes. You may also want to consider your proportions in terms of your body shape. Where do you carry your weight? Are you top heavy? Are you bottom heavy? This is all going to kind of influence the style of short that you're going for. So if you are top heavy, then you may want to balance out your body shape with a wide leg short or even a culotte style. So you can get even more coverage here and more comfort without having to reveal too much of the legs. You could even go for something below the knee. So you're getting that, um, the coolness of shorts and that summer vibe in your outfit without revealing too much. And that will work really well for anybody who's top heavy. 
If you are fuller around the, um, the tummy area or the hips, and smaller on top, you may feel like a pair of cycling shorts that come down to you know mid thigh or just be, uh, above the knee, paired with um, a blazer or something like that, could work really well for you. Now this is a style be warned that has been trending with, uh, you know I would say was associated with people in their twenties, um, that kind of age group, uh, but that's not to say that it's exclusively to that age group anybody can wear this. Again, I'm coming back to your confidence levels. Where is your confidence at? Maybe that's what needs to be worked on. Now, if you did want to go for a pair of denim shorts that are kind of mid-thigh or maybe a little bit higher um, because you're in hot weather climates, maybe. Um, I know a lot of places in the States right now are gonna be you know, pretty hot. Um, I used to live in the Middle East, pretty hot this time of year. Not necessarily too hot in Ireland. I mean, I'm wearing jeans today. If you wanted to wear shorts, short shorts, and you're concerned about revealing too much of the leg. What I often do is I wear something like a kimono, something similar to what I'm wearing here today. So a long style um, garment that gives you coverage on the legs without uh, covering the legs. It gives you that little bit of comfort, you know? So if you're not fond of the legs, give yourself that little bit of protection, you know? Some people are very concerned about the backs of their legs, there might be a bit of cellulite there. Nothing wrong with that. Again, work on your confidence. But a kimono or a duster style coat just might give you that little bit of coverage that you're lacking in just a pair of shorts and a t-shirt. It's also a really nice way to style up a t-shirt and shorts to something a little bit more elevated. If you are somebody who is um, a little fuller in their shape, um, and you might find that, you know, in summer, your legs might chafe. The center, the middle part of your legs might chafe. Cycling shorts can be great at relieving you of this. Um, you could put shorts on underneath a little summer dress, for example. Um, and that's another way to wear shorts if you are uncomfortable in just shorts alone. So we're kind of thinking outside the box here about, okay, I want to wear shorts, doesn't matter what age I am, doesn't matter what size I am, shorts are an option for you. We've got to work on the confidence levels and then we've got to work on, well, how much of the leg do you want to reveal? What are you comfortable with? We've got to think about body proportions. How can we create a balanced silhouette? But at the end of the day, we've got to think about, are you happy and comfortable in what you're wearing? Always remember that these rules or guidelines are just, guidelines and rules are made to be broken and you can wear absolutely anything you want if you choose to do so. Wear it, own it, rock it, have fun with it. That's it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and I will see you again next time. Take care.